Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will cover how to manage discounts on your NapCommerce site. For this tutorial, we are using version 3.70. Offering discounts and promotions can be a vital marketing strategy for a NapCommerce site. Discounts don't only help your customers, they also help your business. In NapCommerce, you can use discounts to enable access to great offers. Let's go to the administration section to learn more about managing discounts. From the promotion menu, select discounts. Here you can see the list of all the discounts that you have created for a store site. Let's try adding a new discount. Specify the name of the discount. Discount type. You can select any option from the list. Assign to order total. These discounts are applied to entire customer order. Assign to products. After this discount is created, the store owner has to assign this discount to a product. You can use the Apply to Product tab. Assign to Categories. Similar to the previous option, the store owner has to assign this discount to a category using the Apply to Categories tab. Assign to Manufacturer. Just like previous two options, the store owner has to assign this discount to a manufacturer. You can use the Apply to Manufacturer tab. Assign to Shipping. These discounts are applied to the shipping fee. Assigned to order subtotal. These discounts are applied to the order subtotal value. For this example, we are going to use assigned to order total. Use percentage. Check this option to apply a percentage discount to the order. Discount amount. Or you can enter the discount amount to the apply to the order. For this example, we are going to use discount amount and specify $10 for discount. Start date. Select the beginning of the discount period from the calendar. End date. You can specify the end date for the discount period. Require code. This will allow your customers to enter the code during the checkout process. For this example, we are going to use test code. Discount limitation. Select the required limitation regarding the discount. Unlimited. Select this option to enable the discount to be used for an unlimited number of times. End times only. Select this option to enable the discount to be used any number of times only. End times per customer. Select this option to enable the discount to be used end times per customer. For this example, we are going to use unlimited. Save and continue. Now let's look into the other options, such as requirements. Here you can specify a requirement for a discount, such as customer has spent an amount in order to avail the discount. Customer has all these products in the car, or customer has one of these products in the car, in which you can specify a product that needs to be in the shopping cart so that customer can use the discount, or must be assigned to customer role, so that discount is based on the customer role. Use his history. Here you can keep a track of all the usage of the discount that you have created once your customer has started using discount on the public store. Let's go to the public store and use the discount coupon code. Let's copy the discount code here. Go to public store. Open a product page. And add the product to the shopping cart. Now on the shopping cart page, we can use the coupon. Right now, we have $245 for the order total. Once we apply the coupon code, it should take off the $10 amount from the order total and we have the remaining balance. And this is how we manage discount in NavCommerce. There are no limits to the number of discount codes you can create. You can add or create as many discounts as you require. Now it's time for us to wrap up this tutorial video. Hope this was helpful. This video is brought to you by Knob Commerce, open source shopping cart. Thank you.